Hello class, this is your instructor, Skylar Huff. I'm here to help you all with the current events procedure. So to start things off, I'm at the coastalabama.edu homepage. And of course, you all should navigate over to students. Upon navigating over to students, as you do click, go down to where it says library. At the library, you will then move over to the left, where it says the Alabama Virtual Library. Upon clicking that, this is where it will take you to the AVL, the Alabama Virtual Library. From there, you may then move over to Student Resources and go on down to where it says College and University Students. Here, it will take you to the resources for you all, the college students. Now, you may click the Academic Search Premier, and upon clicking Search, it will bring you all to the basic EBSCO host search. So before we do our search, I'll help you all to limit your results to one of two publications. The other video showed you the American Scientist, and this will be about the scientific American. And of course, I better spell the scientific American correctly. Now that I've done that, I will then just do a quick search for uh, with plants this time because I do love plants. I'll click search, and here we are. So as you can see, there are approximately 269 different results here. As I scroll down, I'll suppose I will pick building tastier fruits and veggies. You must have fruits and vegetables. So once we get here, the article does come up. And I'll go to the HTML for text. So this is indeed the article, the entire article that's here. I'll scroll down just a bit more. And I'm not going to read the article to you, of course, but this gives you everything you all need for your current event. The next thing I'll show you will be how to cite this article. So it does say cite here. So I'll click where it says cite, and it gives you the different citation formats, being Bio 104, or Bio 103, or just any, I would say, science class I'm teaching. I would say we want to restrict this to APA, and it does give you the correct format for APA. So I would say this will be the only time I would allow you all to copy and paste. So all you should do is highlight the correct APA citation. Upon doing that, you copy that. I just pressed Command C since I'm using the Mac. From there, to help you with pasting in the correct citation, what I'll say you can do is click the down arrow here and click Keep Source Formatting. Or you can alternatively click Edit and go to Paste and Match Formatting or Paste Special and keep the formatting as is. So now you have correctly cited your document. So now we're back here, and that is how you appropriately find your current event. If you need any further help, please let me know. I've enjoyed helping.